Hey, Vintage Breakers, we are about to open a 1961 Topps Baseball First Series Cellar Pack. We are looking for high-grade examples of Brooks Robinson, Ron Santo rookie, Mickey Mantle League leader, Roger Maris, by the way, is 15,000 plus in the PSA 10, Ron Santo, uh, Killebrew, Brooks Robinson, and the league leader with Mickey Mantle, that's the AL home run leaders, are 5,000 plus in PSA 10s. There's also possible high-grade examples of Richie Ashburn, Nelly Fox, Billy Martin. Hey, hey what's up, Chef? Uh, Robin Roberts and Dick Rote, as well as other PSA 10 league leader cards featuring Clemente Koufax, Willie Mays, and Hank Aaron. Let's random off the order here. Five times. Guys, I'm going to tell you right now, 61 cellos are a lot of fun. One, two. Now, remember, the top card... Bob Turley is spot number one because he's the top card. Four and five. Okay. Late whenever, about to crack it open. Yeah, we cracked it about uh, 30 seconds. All right, the order's done as well. All right, guys. Hey, what's up, Mike? What's up, John? By the way, that 2011 update box... Don't sleep on that. It's creeping and creeping and creeping along. And uh, we're definitely in the mid-20s on that box. I think it's 27 spots left. Before you turn around, that's going to go. So I'm about to crack open. And what I'm going to do, in honor of my man Charles G, with our Vintage Breaks uh, logoed uh, goggles, high-grade goggles, by the way. I'm going to put them on over my glasses. Charles G, thanks, man. Nobody else has these goggles. Nobody else has their own custom goggles. Only us at Vintage Breaks. We rack. Let me get open this cello. All right, man. Ready to go. Thanks, Charles. Did the trick. I even wore the goggles, Leighton. Excellent. Did they get a shout out? Yeah, I did a shout out to Charles G. My That's man. Awesome. My man, my mellow. Get on the mic because you know you eat jello. If anybody can tell me whose lyrics those are, they're going to get a $10 break credit. First person to in the chat to write whose lyrics those were, get a $10 break credit. It's a little trivia. It's a little trivia. It's a little 80s. My manicure is horrible. Horrible. Let's go. If nobody knows, I'm going to take the $10 break credit myself. Just kidding. Colonel Angus, not Coolio. Good try, though. <laughs> All right. Just hang tight for a minute. Leighton's getting ready. You know, he'll do the introduction, of course, which will be uh, for uh, Sports Collectors Daily. Again, you got your opportunity to spend 25 bucks to get a 1973 set break spot. Vanilla Ice, Beastie Boys, Roots, Elton John. Close, Doug, but no, no cigar. <laughs> Big League Sports Cards is the winner. Can you just give a $10 break credit? Hmm? Big League Sports Cards? Bismarcky. That's right. Uh, what's Big League Sports? Big League, remind me of your name again. I always forget. I can't even remember my own, so don't take any offense to that. I won't forget this time. I think I'm going to figure it out. I don't remember. I don't, remember, I don't remember anymore. My memory is terrible. <coughs> Excuse me, Mike. It's accessible. I think you should try to show Sports Selectors Daily folks the two roses and the Starback that we pulled earlier tonight. Uh, not accessible. Only the, the Starback is. Great. So I'll grab so that. that. And then also, what are we going to break out? Actually, I lied to you. They're right here. Right. Well, I don't mean to lie. 
Well, uh, so in regards to uh, what's after the 61 cell, did you have something? Yes, in we're going to broke 2000 Leaf Limited football box, possible Tom Great. Brady. And you have a vintage pack you can tell as well that'll be coming up? Yes, we'll do a 1973 high number baseball wax pack. Very cool. Do you have that actual pack? Oh, yeah. Wonderful. Talk to folks about that. All right. Excellent. Appreciate everyone's patience. Mikey, I think right after the 61 cello, yeah. you should go into a Guess That Gum. Okay. Uh, so that way the folks Sports Collectors Daily get it. on the standby. So when you talk about it on Sports Collectors Daily. Right okay, great. Here we are running. Excellent. We're on record. Uh, okay, let me get it going. Yeah, it's cool. Yeah, definitely. This race is about to open. Just sit tight, everybody. Be about 15 seconds. You said your special is when you're opening the pack? It's still going. It's still going. Okay. Start at 9 o'clock till I'm done with the pack. And it's 20 bucks. 25 bucks. 25 bucks and two per person. That's it. Yep. So you spend fifty, you get fifty. Two. Which is about to open the top baseball okay. first race. Pack. Looking for Maris, Mantle. Okay, I want to take all his closed. Big ears. Tilbury. Clemente spot. I don't know if it's still going. Is are we still going on that winner take all with Clemente? So Mike, what's uh, actually I'll mention this uh, when we go live on here. Oh, that's a fun way to. I like that, Mike. Yeah, once in a while. I'm an interior designer for clients. Absolutely. Thanks, everybody, for hanging out. What's up, Mikey, Chef, Mark, Big League, Colonel, Adam, hope you're feeling all right, bud. Dr. E, I think I, if I saw you earlier, Mr. Jordan and everyone else, let's uh, get down to 61 solo. Hey, good evening, folks. We are VintageBreaks.com, coming to you live from the 459 here in Somerset, New Jersey, less than one mile from the oldest or one of the oldest colleges in the United States. So we are about to open a 1961 Topps Baseball First Series Cello Pack. You can see we've already cracked it out of its PSA tomb. We're ready to uh, rip open and unearth to see what's in this mini time capsule. Big shout out to Rich Miller from Sports Collectors Daily. Great place to get your hobby news. It's the only place that I go every morning to check my hobby news when my son Crosby allows me. Without further ado, we're going to let Mikey take over. I'm showing some stuff in the background here. We're going to talk about that in just a minute. We've already pulled two Pete Rose 1970 Tops uh, six series cards from a six series cello right here live on YouTube.com slash Vintage Breaks. You can check us out right after uh, we sign off here on Facebook. Check out this beaut. 72 top stallback rookie straight from a rack pack live from the 459 and then right after the 61 top cello for your viewing pleasure we're going to be opening up a 1973 tops baseball high number wax pack looking for a schmitty rookie in high grade all right everybody good luck good luck to john a chris jeff mark dr e kurt chef jeff g dom todd and robert good luck everybody so, Mikey, before you open that, if you can give a little close-up on Sports Selectors Daily, the actual pack, that would be wonderful. Great. A lot of possibilities in this uh, first series pack. Roger Maris, Mickey Mantle, League Leader card, Harmon Killebrew, Nelly Fox, Billy Martin, a slew of leader cards. Yeah. Featuring Clemente, 
Koufax, Aaron, Mays, etc. This is going to be a lot of fun. Thanks, everybody, for being patient while I'm getting the camera set. Okay. We ready to go? Yep, we're ready Top to go. card, John A. gets to Bob Turley. Let's see what else is sitting in this beautiful pack. Tightly wrapped, of course. Mike, as you're getting started there, I want to let everyone know on Sports Lectures Daily that we are running a free NCAA tournament bracket pool. You can find out the details at VintageBreaks.com or go directly to Event.VintageBreaks.com. In our free tournament pool, the top prize is a Kareem Abdul-Jabbar rookie, PSA 4. All you need to do is to basically beat everyone else in the tournament. Probably pick the winner, Final Four maybe. Check it out, Event.VintageBreaks.com. Let's get started on the 61 seller. Okay, John A., Bob Turley. I like it when the centering changes. Yeah. It's a good sign. Thanks for dropping a link in there for the free pull, Sam. I already have about 50 folks registered. <coughs> Dick. Of course, they don't do the uh, you know selection show Sunday night. Right. Wow, the centering on these shows <coughs> got real. This is dead nuts, dude. Great. So who has the second card in the pack? Chris T? Mm-hmm. Oh, yeah, Chris. We'll grade that on the house for you, but I don't even have to look at it more closely. That's fantastic. Hold on one second. I want to make sure Sports Lectures Daily. Look at that beauty. All right. Jeff G, spot three. Jerry Lynch, another. Do you see the center on that? This is smoking. Pull some action, Jackson. Let's see what we got. Gorgeous. Whose card is that? Number three? That is Jeff G. Jeff, we're going to grade that on the house for you. Check out that blazer. Wow. Very nice. Just one after the other because the next card's ridiculous. You got a Maris like that? I fall over. Thanks for joining us, folks, in Sports Collectors Daily. If you Mark want to a. continue watching afterwards, you can do so on YouTube.com slash Vintage Breaks. And if you like what you see, please be sure to subscribe to our channel. We go live Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, and Friday nights. Wow, that is a beauty. Uh, who's uh, Mark Aram. Mark A. What's up, bud? Hope all is well down there in Georgia. He did give us a shout-out on his live broadcast today. Oh, very cool. Well, we're going to grade out in the house for you. I mean, this is ridiculous. What's the pop on the Norm ca Cash? Is this, he's rookie, he's 58 or 59? 59. 59, 59 high number. So it's card number 95, 61 tops. I I'm just, I'm just want to see something here. There are a lot of folks watching, Mike and Sports Collectors Daily, other folks who help us with that. Absolutely. It's a high, high dollar nine. Yeah, I'd like to see if there's a 10. Here's a checklist, first series. Another very nice centered card. Yeah, Richard, these cards look great. For Eric, Dr. E. Uh, Dr. E, I know it's only a checklist, bud, but that card looks awesome. We'll make sure we get this in focus. We're going to agree that on the house for you. That's a beauty. Card number 91. We're working on the set. That's a 95. great card. If not, sell it and buy a nice 61 you're looking for. Pop two? In 10. Oof. How many nines? 49. Yeah, it's like a $300 nine. $250 nine, give or take. I didn't even mention Klazuski at the start of the Look broadcast. Look at the centering on it. Yeah, no, this is great. Chef will be happy. Why don't pull a Maris that looks like that, man? That would be worth a lot of money in so a this nine is for higher. Kurt. <clears throat> Make sure we get a nice shot right there. Awesome centering on that card. If you're working on a 61 Tops baseball set, if money was no object, you get yourself a nice <clears throat> bottle of whatever your favorite wine is. You sit down, I don't know, once a week, once a month, depending on what the budget allows. That's right. Oh, is, there, is it a mantle? Mm -hmm. oh. So there's a possible mantle leader in the first series, as well as Clemente, Koufax, Aaron Mays. It's uh, chock full of uh, stars in the first series on the leader cards. This has been a great pack. Whose card is that card? Chef. Seven. Chef, uh, that's yours, bud. We're going to grade that on the house. Ronald, right, because for vintage cards, it doesn't matter. You know, if you're breaking a chrome product, I could certainly see, uh, you know, using uh, gloves and such. But that's why. 
Thanks for joining us. I can't see from here. Is that Mickey? Uh -uh. Wow, these cards are beautiful. What's up, Michael? Thanks for joining us, bud. Whose card is that? John A. John A, we're going to grade that on the house for you. This is a crazy pack. Yeah. This is cool. Ooh. A little bit off -centered. Yeah, this is going to be a fun... Uh, Mike's now a photographer in his part-time, part-time game. <laughs> Who do we got here, Mikey? Can't see... Uh, can't read in the dark. Can you mention the players? Bonnie. Everyone? Jim Bonnie. Okay. Early win. Okay, great. Two Hall of Famers. Yeah, two Hall of Famers. Great. If you want to show everyone here, a couple Hall of Famers on this. Early win and Jim Bunning. Beautiful card. <laughs> I thought that was, I thought that was Maris. Oh, man. I mean, it looks like a gorgeous card from here. I can't see. Koufax a little bit off center, right? So you have two Hall of Famers, though. So, Dom, this is your card, bud. You know, great players, just a little bit off-center, unfortunately. And I think the last card was uh, good enough to grade, and if it was, uh, Jeff will grade that on the house for you. <laughs> Beautiful. Okay. And that's the bottom card. Yeah, with Frank Robbins. It looks like it came out pretty well. It's a popular card. It's a little OC top to bottom. <clears throat> Ted, Todd Davidson. Hector Lopez. Oh, that's a beauty. So check out the centering on this. For those that are working on a 61 set or just maybe a Yankee team set in high grade, that is a gorgeous card. We're going to grade that in the house for you. That's going out to Todd. Yes, sir. Congratulations, Todd. It's a nice card. And uh, Mr. Robert Jordan gets the Heavy Artillery Reds card with Frank Robinson, Veda Pinson, and Gus Bell. Ooh, that's pretty nice, too. looks like eight quality. Depends on how the quarters were at the bottom of the pack. If that's gradable, Robert will grade that uh, on the house for you, bud. So what's uh, what pack is next, Mikey? We're doing a 73 Tops baseball pack. High number. High number. If you want to show everyone what that pack looks like on Sports Selectors Daily, if you want to check us out, please stop on by youtube.com slash vintage breaks. We're also breaking a 2,000 Leaf limited football box. And if you want to check out our free, yeah, that's right, free. You don't have to buy anything at all. We appreciate everyone in the collecting hobby. Big shout out to Rich and Sports Collectors Daily. Check out our free promotion, event.vintagebreaks.com. We're giving away 16 prizes, including a 1969 Tops, Cream Up Jewels Your Bar Rookie, and a PSA 4. And we have another pool running where we're giving away a Michael Jordan 1986 Fleer PSA 6. All the details, you can find them at event.vintagebreaks.com. Thanks again, Sports Selectors Daily fans. Have a great evening. Thank you, everybody. This is pretty cool. You like it, Layton? That was amazing. Now we're going to get a Schmidt. I want to buy 10 more, but unfortunately I have nowhere to, I don't know what to do. They're not easy to find. Yeah. They've dried up. That was a nice pack. Really nice pack. Nice, nice pack. Alright, so that thing you're just cut the left off since you're done? Yep. Alright. I'll tell you the names. No, you gotta do well, it's not a, it's not a random. So just email to Victoria Vintage Rakes. That was amazing. And just these are the names and this is and they each get two you know, however many spots. Okay. That's great. Dude, look at this picture. Yeah, it's going to be awesome. Wow. Which uh, set spot did we get? 73. Okay. Gorgeous, gorgeous cards, guys. 61.